going on you guys week eight busy week but um we're gonna do this uh the weekday games so there's one game i'm talking about on thursday there's gonna be two games on friday and then i'm gonna tomorrow i'm gonna upload saturday's games so we'll start with arkansas state at appalachian state on 7 30 espn tonight uh, the spread is 13 minus 13 for appalachian state the over under 67. Uh, the big thing for me in this game is App State's defense is only giving up 321 yards a game, and you might think that's a lot, but compared to the other teams, it's it's not as much. Some of the other, a lot of the other teams, especially in the Sun Belt, they're giving up like 380 to 400. I think Arkansas State's defensive secondary is going to be an issue here. They're allowing 306 yards a game passing. And then another like 120 or so uh, rushing a game. I do think that takes a factor because I think Appalachian State does play some very balanced football on both sides of the ball. I think they're averaging 140 yards of passing or 120 yards passing and 140 yards rushing a game. And they are... On offense, they're also playing well-balanced, almost going for 200 average each, rushing and throwing. So I think they're a more balanced football team. I think they will be a little bit more disciplined. So I think Appalachian State is going to win this game 31-23. to Next game is Tulsa at USF, 7.30 ESPN on Friday. Uh, Tulsa is favorite by 10.5. The over-under is 51. My player to watch is definitely Zach Smith, Tulsa quarterback, to see how he manages the game. They're not scoring many points. Neither team are actually putting up many, very many points a game. Uh, Tulsa's putting up about 20. USF is putting up about 19. But Tulsa has played, I think, a little bit better opponents. I think USF should be doing a little bit better on the offensive side of the ball but they are not, and USF gives up way too many points a game. Way too many. You, Tulsa is still in that 20 range for giving up. USF is well in the 30s, so not too sure how USF will win this game. I don't think they will. I think Tulsa is going to win 27-7. to Next game, 8 o'clock on CBS Sports Network on Friday, is Louisiana at UAB. UAB is favored by one. Uh, the over-under is 50 in this game. My player to watch or thing to watch is Louisiana's defensive line. Last week when they played Coastal Carolina, they talked about their defensive front and how they were very good. Well, they didn't look very, very good because last week on 48 carries, they allowed 212 yards. So... They got to avoid that being ran over like that. They got to get off the field. I think Louisiana is a little fired up. I think they will bounce back. I think they'll win 34 to 28. But I will not be surprised if UEB does win this game. They're a good football team, especially if they get Spencer Brown working. And it's funny because they proved, UAB proved that. Even when Spencer Brown doesn't have the best game, I believe last week he had 12 carries for 22 yards and they still won the game. So they're proving it's not just a Spencer Brown show. So I do think Louisiana bounces back. I will not be surprised if UAB wins this game. But as I said, I think Louisiana wins 34 to 28. That's it for the weekday predictions. So this is pretty much part one. Part two will be out tomorrow. It's a little bit later in the week. Uh, some stuff was going on with ESPN for me and my computer. That's it for the weekday games. I'll see you for the Saturday predictions. Don't forget to like and subscribe.